Here we are, nice, beautiful, sunny morning, flat seas. What do you think, Chris? Awesome. Pretty awesome. Good. Great night camping out last night. Our neighbors were loud though, so that kind of sucked. On the water day two, hoping for a redo of yesterday with uh, some lings and plenty of coho. So we're gonna see if those coho haven't moved on and we're hoping they're just sitting there. There was a lot of bait, so we think that that's gonna hold them. It didn't take long to get into our first fish of the day. We haven't seen it yet. We don't know if it's a rockfish or a coho, but it's been fighting hard. Oh, there's a there's four of them on the screen, five of them on the screen. Look at those fish right there. That thing's pulling pretty darn hard. Yeah, that'd be cool. There was a bunch on the screen back there. I know. That's why I'm thinking it's a rockfish. Yeah. Maybe it's just one of those big ones like we got yesterday. A ling? Really? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, it ate the rockfish. Whoa! Crazy. And there went the rockfish. Yeah. Wow. Almost got a two for one. That was cool. Get the two for one video? That was the first that was the first fish yesterday and the first fish today, right? Or I guess the first link. Nice wow. Link. Good job, man. You stoked? That's awesome. Dude, I, I was like, man, why isn't he pulling harder on it? It's just a rockfish. <laughs> it ends up being a big old link on. Nice that's how big the rockfish was in its mouth? Yeah. yeah. Aaron just had one on, and uh, Chris was coming over to, to check on him and maybe get a picture or something like that, and he hooked one, and so then they had a double hookup going, and, and Aaron's fish was a small little wild fish that he turned loose, and then the other one got away. Oh, here's all that bait. Right here. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna hook one here in five, four, three, two, one. Nope. Oh, but Dave has one on. Shoot, I called it for him, not for me. Look at that. Look at that. That's your fish right there. Is it off? No, that's your fish. He's going crazy. Okay, Chris is hooked up here. I'm hooked up here too. There's a lot of fish in this spot. Nice one. Dave's got one. Triple hookup.
fish right there. Okay, we're almost limited on coho and we're going to uh, we're gonna try to get the last one and actually Aaron, he's got one on right over there. Oh no, he lost it, shoot. But while they're trying to get their last coho, I'm going to, uh, I'm gonna switch over and try to get some lings. Try to get some ling cod and I got uh, a sage salt, 12 weight with a big grande on this with a big fast sinking line and got a big old fly. So what I'm gonna do here is um, fishing fairly shallow but I'm just looking for fish around this kelp bed that are feeding on this bait that's in here. So we'll see how I do. So a limit of coho, we got several lingcod, bunch of rockfish and heading in, lost a couple fish. Fish, uh, the bite just kind of turned off on us and um, we just figured, hey, it's getting hot. Let's, uh, we've already been on the water eight hours. Maybe this is something you want to do. Let us know if we got, uh, we got spots in upcoming trips, I'm guessing. Check out our website for all the information. Thanks.